Alright you guys, I am in Ross. I'm in a different Ross. This one looks like they have a bigger selection of some decor. Like, more than my local one. Let's take a look at them. Look at this vase right here. It's the first thing I saw. That looks like something I could see in Burlington. They are asking for $13.99. We have this one right here. A little mosaic on top, on the bottom, some tiling. They're asking for $12. Look at this one. This little funky one right here is open in the front. $12. So that is new here. You can do anything you want with this. $12. Look, we got like a king frog. <laughs> That's funny to see. $10. Actually, no. That is $7. So I found this really cool piece here. Look at that. $28. Only 28, that is really cool looking, huh? Yeah, that's sweet. We see a lot of vases here. We always see that up in Burlington. More vases. These are all gonna be $12 right here. We got a lot at this Ross right here. We have that tall one right there. We're gonna see if we can get that one. That one is gonna be $13. We've seen this at Burlington. They want 30 here. I think it's cheaper at Burlington for that. We have some candle holders, 13. These two right here are going to be seven. Let's see. Look at this one. I think this has a lid on it, like a little candy dish. They're asking for seven dollars. This piece is definitely new here. Let me find that price. Seven. And look at this up here. I'm finding a lot of neat stuff like this lately. Even at Home Goods has something similar to that. Thirteen dollars. Very different. Maybe a little green thing, like a. Like a little bubbly one. Four dollars. We have a lot of these. You can find these at um, Home Goods. Let's see how much Ross wants. Eleven. I think almost the same price as Home Goods. We've seen these before, but we've only seen the pink ones. We've seen this at Marshalls. So nine dollars a piece for that. Let's see. Work hard, stay humble. Work hard, stay humble. It just repeats over and over. Seven dollars for that. $13 for this hanging, like a terrarium you can make. What is this, bamboo? Oh, it's a candle, okay. $8 for that one. Oh, we definitely seen this in um, Home Goods and Burlington. Let's see how much they want here. They're asking for seven, that is cheap here. More of these cute little boxes right here. $14, I've been seeing a lot of these and they all say like, you know, made in India or painted by people in India, like I said before. I don't know how true that is. Let's see, what else can I see here? This is new. This is going to be new. 14. And then we have this mosaic piece right here. I like a mermaid-ish. And I think we've seen something like this at another store, I want to say. 13. And then we have a different one back there. Let me see if I can get to that price. 13. So they're both going to be 13. I see a lot of elephants here. Elephants are supposed to mean good luck. Let's see how much this one is. $14. It is not wood, but you know, has that feeling. A silver one, we've seen these before all the time at Burlington. $15. I think that is cheaper than um, Burlington. Oh, look at that weird porcupine right here. Here's a porcupine. That's funny. Look at these funky pieces right here. Aren't those something totally different and funky? This one right here was said it's going to be $13. This one is actually $8. Very different. And kind of cool in a weird way. Reminds me of like one of those for And look, we have this right here. Bali. And like these uh, type of drums. What do you call those? Uh, like a bongo? Oh yeah, these are going to be $10. And what else do they have here? Or more of those funky bowls right there, which are $8.
over here looks like I found some journals. What do we got? Studio 71 watercolor paint set. They're asking for $3.99. We got this funky journal right here. $4.99. We got a lot of journals. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. They have a lot of these at um, Burlington too. You can always find tons of those there. Oh, look, look at that. Paint brushes. That is a cool paintbrush set, right? Ten dollars. Kind of looks like a makeup brush that we always see at Marshalls. Yeah. God grant me serenity. Three dollars. Be bold. Be brave. Be beautiful. Three dollars. Yeah, they got a lot here. Here's another one. Same one. <laughs> she leaves a little sparkle wherever she goes. It's like a photo album. And they're asking for seven. It's got quite a bit of these here. A lot of photo albums up on top. A little more down at the bottom. Let's see. Live, laugh, love. Love you to the moon and back. Oh, that thing is everywhere. I'm actually sick of it. It's like everywhere. They're overdoing it. That and the llamas. <laughs> Our travel book. You know what? This would be good. I think anybody who could travel... I envy you all because <laughs> that's something I would like to do and then like you know take photos and have like a map and then mark a pen on the map or everywhere you've been one day and over here look we have gel pens to get 52 gel pens how much $13 oh this one's a hundred you get a hundred premium gel pens Ooh. do I see a price did I pass it or is it on the bottom on the bottom 20 a lot of art stuff in this section glitter pens five dollars hey not bad you get 50 glitter pens for five dollars that is not bad at all oh that's cool look at this wrap wrapping let me see if i can pull it out this is cute it's a gift wrap it's balloon animals right that is adorable right there It looks like over here everything is for candles. We got a wireless porch light, $17. That's a find. These, oh, limited two. Oh my gosh, that used to be a store. Remember the limited and then they did the limited two? These are lights. They're asking for $8. More string lights right here, $8. Look at quite a bit here. This is solar. Let's see. No price on the solar ones right there. Let's just keep looking. There's another solar one. Oh, look at these pineapple. These are cute. Pineapple string lights. Only $8. All this over here is going to be candles. Candles, candles, candles. Hallmark. I didn't even know Hallmark made candles. Sunshine. Clementine Splash. $8. Um, sometimes some of these don't smell good. Seven dollars for that. I smell something, but I don't know where it's coming from. Here is Blueberry Dream, Bloom and Prosper. 
I think I might be smelling this one. Oh, look at the front of that. Mm, no, this one does not smell good at all. Let's see. It might be this um, Good Day Sunshine. Let's smell that one. Six dollars. Okay, yeah, it is a Good Day Sunshine. And I think it might be mixed with this Summer Pineapple right here. Let me smell that one. Oh, yeah. <laughs> These two mixed together smell really good. Um, somebody told me that candles are not good for you. I have candles, but I rarely light them. I only light them around Christmas time. And that's about it. Let's see. I think this is just like all candles and air freshener. What's behind me? A little more signs. Begin each day with a grateful heart. A couple more signs right here. Home is wherever I am with you. Okay, we've seen stuff like that before. All right, let's walk out of here. It's getting crowded. Let's make our way to this section over here. We got some lamps here. Thirty dollars. We've seen that at Home Goods right there. Forty dollars cheaper at Home Goods and better quality. This you could find in Burlington. Looks like stuff in India. Yeah. And then look at this one right here. This is really cool. This is gonna be twenty. Oh, that's a little lamp, isn't it? Yeah, it's like inside. That's neat. Here is a couple bathroom stuff right here. Look at that one. Eight dollars. We got a longer one down here at the bottom, more of a rectangular shape. They're asking for ten. Look at this piece right here. Really cool looking. I think this is in the wrong spot. This looks like it's supposed to be in the kitchen area right here. Um, they're asking for thirteen dollars. Finally made it to the bedding. At this Ross, they got a lot of Steve Madden bedding. Here's this pattern, eighteen dollars. Here's another Steve Madden. This is gonna be for a full fifteen. Oh wow, this Ross is totally stocked in my local one. I noticed when you shop locally, like one down the street from your house, is usually not that great, and you have to go a little farther. Twenty-four for that California King. We got some Betsy Johnson. Let me see this. Skulls, fourteen. Hmm. Then a plain like mint green, fourteen. A gray Betsy. Here's another Betsy Johnson right here. She's asking for $18. Well, Ross is. Let's see. $18 here. Oh, what's this one down here? Let me see this pattern. Oh, yeah. Little $20. Yep. Here's some more patterns right here. Villa Chic, $20. Um, this brand, I can't say it, but I see it all the time with the alligator. 35. La Costa. La Costa. I don't know. If you guys know it, let me know how to say it. <laughs> Here's another queen. $35. But I've seen that brand with the alligator. Just didn't know what it was. Oh, we got Nautica. 30 Let's see. This is it, you guys. This is it. We got quite a bit. Pillowcases are going to be in the back. More Nautica right here, 30. Another Nautica, 30 again. And finally, we're heading into the pillow section. Look at these blue Nauticas. But oh, these are, they're cute, but you know what? They're not in a, they're not in a baggy. Well, I guess, you know, Walmart, you know how Walmart has like a bend of big pillars? Pillows, pillars, <laughs> a pillow, <laughs> pillows not in a bag. But yeah, they have those here. I guess you could wash them, maybe put a baggie over them. I hear when you buy something like that, you're supposed to just stick them in the dryer. I don't know. Um, let's see. They're asking. Let's see if I can find a price on one. There should be at the tag. Okay. Those. Are, um, these right here are gonna be ten dollars. And then they got more pillows here. Oh, here's a Nautica two pack. It is sealed. Twenty. 20 for two okay guys that is it for this video it is getting crowded in here look at this funky quilted cat blanket <laughs> oh my gosh like that is funny okay you guys that is it for this video thank you so much for watching is that a betsy i know betsy there's <laughs> a betsy right there that's funny um you know what a lot of people say betsy is ugly and tacky you know i think she's different and I think that's why I like her. Some items I like of hers and some I don't. But that's it, you guys. Thanks so much for watching. And have a great week. And I will see you next time.